Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters The Locked Fridge Someone is trying to open a locked fridge. Will they be successful? VDSG The sole survivor may encounter a scavenger attempting to open a novice locked refrigerator. If approached, they will become hostile. Inside the refrigerator is a random gun, some caps, and matching ammo. This is possibly a reference to an identical encounter in Fallout 3. With the intimidation perk, it is possible to pacify the scavenger, open the refrigerator and leave. Once far enough away, he will take the gun from the fridge and will use it if approached again. However, this seems related to the AI always picking nearby weapons, as he will not leave and act as if it's still locked. Additionally, any caps inside will remain there. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters The Hatch Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters The Hatch A scavenger blows open the doors of a bomb shelter. Deal with him, then head inside and see what you find. VDSG The sole survivor may encounter a hatch and a scavenger in the wasteland. Upon talking to the scavenger, he will state that the hatch is his. Putting the cursor on the hatch will prompt detonate, and doing so will result in a mini nuke like explosion, after which the player character can enter the bunker to find a skeleton and some minor loot in what seems to be a collapsed fallout shelter. Alternatively, the sole survivor can wait for the scavenger to detonate the hatch. After this, the scavenger will excitedly shout that it worked and enter the shelter. He will become hostile if the player character follows him into the bunker. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters The Hatch Behind the Scenes Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters The Hatch Behind the Scenes This is also a reference to Locke blowing the door off of The Hatch in Exodus Part 2, an episode of the TV series Lost. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Water Beggar A parched chap hopes you have some water. Offer him some if you're a kind-hearted type. VDSG The sole survivor may encounter a settler kneeling by the side of the road. If talked to, they will claim they are tired and ask for water. If the sole survivor is currently carrying any purified water, they may offer it to the settler. They will thank them, and if talked to again, will say that they just need to rest for a bit longer before moving on. There is no option to send them to an own settlement after giving them the water. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Poison Gal An irradiated dame hopes you have some rat away. Offer her some if you're a kind-hearted type. VDSG Similar to the water beggar, the sole survivor may encounter a woman who claims to be dying from radiation and asks for rat away. It's even possible for this woman to be generated as a ghoul, who are supposed to be immune to radiation. If you give her some, she thanks you and says she needs to rest before continuing. There is no further option for interaction. If one returns to the location at a later date she will be smashed by a safe. If you refuse to give rat away to the woman and return later, she will be replaced with a dead ghoul. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Safe Landing Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Safe Landing Did you find a locked safe lying in a small crater? Then unlock it. VDSG1 can sometimes come across a locked chest, from novice to master, in a small crater, suggesting it was thrown away by a powerful explosion or dropped from the sky. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Vault Tech Van If anyone knows the whereabouts of Larry, last seen heading to a commonwealth vault, please inform the documentation department. He has a note regarding the vault in person. VDSG the sole survivor can find a fairly unique van in quite good shape, but empty. On its right side is a skeleton in rags and a torn note that reads, M. Henderson. I hate to remind you again, but you failed to meet your quota last month. We still have spots to fill in vault 95 and you have not been pulling. The rest is torn and the other side reads, Dud are making people uncomfortable. This is your last warning. If you don't reach your target this month, you're out. Ralph Jones. Part of the signature is torn, but the last part reads, Manager, Vault Tech, Fallout 4 Random Encounters, General Object Encounters, Settler Burial, A group of settlers are burying a friend. VDSG Occasionally. The sole survivor will witness a preacher and three settlers gathered around a fourth buried settler. 
Upon approaching, the preacher will hold a short eulogy, followed by the settlers saying their goodbyes to the departed. The first attendee, male, mourns a good friend, the second one, female, mourns the person she loved and a third one, male, Marcus, bitterly questions the point of grieving after the deceased, before breaking into tears, declaring it's not fair, as he is, the asshole of the group, and should have been the one to die in his place. The others console him before the preacher ends the funeral. None of the four can be talked to. They just answer with a generic greeting for dialogue less NPCs. The preacher wears the pastor's vestments. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Max Bar Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Max Bar Mac is setting up a bar. Is this a strange place for a bar? You decide. VDSG occasionally, the sole survivor may find a bar set up in random places that belongs to a man named Mac. The sole survivor can purchase drinks and initiate a conversation with him about the bar location. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Brahmin Corpse with Mines Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Brahmin Corpse with Mines The Body of a Brahmin with Three Mines Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Junked Car with Ambush Feral Ghouls Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Junked Car with Ambush Feral Ghouls A Yellow Colored Sports Car Cherry Bomb with Two Feral Ghouls Waiting in an Ambush Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Greaser Taking Parts from a Car Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Greaser Taking Parts from a Car Duke is one of the Atom Cats. He can give the coordinates to their garage. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Radioactive Barrels Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Radioactive Barrels A Few Radioactive Barrels Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Brahmin Corpse and Vermin Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Brahmin Corpse and Vermin Two Bloodbugs Sitting on the Body of a Dead Brahmin Sucking Its Blood Or Two Bloodbugs Soaring Above the Body Or Three Bloodbugs Over the Body of a Radstag When the survivor approaches them, they take off from the dead body and attack the protagonist. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Pile of Burning Tires Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Pile of Burning Tires A Large Pile of Burning Tires Caution Flammable Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Simple Minefield Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Simple Minefield Several Frag Mines Compactly Lying and Which Can Be Neutralized Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Vertebrate on Ground vs. Gunners Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Vertebrate on Ground vs. Gunners The Sole Survivor, after the arrival of the airship the Pridewin in the Commonwealth, can detect in a random location level 3 gunners opposing level 4 members of the Brotherhood of Steel. Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Radioactive Barrel plus Giant Glowing Frenzied Creature Fallout 4 Random Encounters General Object Encounters Radioactive Barrel plus Giant Glowing Frenzied Creature A Frenzied Glowing Creature Found Near Radioactive Barrels